Welcome to my channel. Wireless and Wi-Fi Repeater Setup Wireless and Repeater Setup via Web GUI Once you plug in the extender to an electrical outlet, the power light will turn green and the Wi-Fi light will blink. The next step requires you to connect the repeater to your computer or cell phone either through Wi-Fi or via Ethernet cable. For Wi-Fi, you need to go to Wi-Fi list on your laptop or cell phone and look for the wireless and network name and connect to it. Ethernet connection can be established by connecting Ethernet cable from extender to your computer slash laptop. After the extender is connected with your either or computer slash laptop slash cell phone you can go for a web-based setup. Open an internet browser of your choice. Type 192.168.10.1 in the address bar. It will open the login page for. Enter the login details and hit login. The default username and password for wireless and Wi Fi repeater is admin. On the next screen under Wizard option, you will have to select among app mode or repeater mode. It will now scan and show you the list of Wi-Fi network names available, select your router Wi-Fi name. Enter the password for the same to complete wireless and Wi-Fi repeater setup. Hit apply, it takes around 60 seconds to apply the settings. Later connect your devices with underscore ext network showing in your Wi-Fi list. Setup wireless and repeater via WPS. For this setup, you have to make sure both extender and router are within the same room or in the range of 5 to 10 feet. Plug in the extender to the wall outlet and wait till power light gets stable. Push the WPS button on your router. Depending on the model it can be on the back or on the front. Within 2 minutes push the WPS button on the extender as well. WPS on both the devices will be blinking. Usually, it takes just 15 to 20 seconds to configure the wireless and repeater via WPS. Once successful WPS LED on extender will turn solid and you will see a new network name in your Wi-Fi list. You can choose to keep the same Wi-Fi name as your router or customize it as per your choice. The password is also same for the extender as your router. Thanks for watching.